it's Monday morning, school holidays have begun. So it's now half past ten and we're baking cakes. Ooh, so my bakers are very busy making a mess. Um, my new mattress has been delivered. Yay! So I've got to get that on the bed. The old the, the mattress that we ordered that was wrong has gone back, thank goodness. I can now get my conservatory for the first time in four weeks. Um, my new mattress is in the hallway. So we're baking cakes, sorting mattresses, and I may have bought the red car. I feel a bit sick actually, so we're just in the process. We're just in the process of sorting out number plates and stuff and I can't see there, so I sit on the cushion. Right, for you again. Right now you need to get the sieve. I don't need the sieve in. Yeah, you can. Get the sieve on there. Yeah. And you just need a little bit of this. Of what? This flour and cocoa flour and cocoa powder. Just a bit. That's enough. That'll do. Right, get the sieve in. Because it's the end. That's right. We've well, got to beat it in in a minute. Yeah. We now have to fetch the dogs back from the dog groomers. Talk about multitask on a Monday morning. It's supposed to be relaxing. It's supposed to be holiday time. And I feel as relaxed as nothing. I'm so stressed. Right. Off we go to get the dogs. Right. We've had to leave Winnie there because she's got a caught a claw and it's bleeding so they've got to wait for it to stop bleeding so I've got to go back in a bit for Winnie so we're going to walk the floor Right, back to the cake people. How's it going? Fine. Yeah? Yep. All good. Right, cakes are in the oven. They look yummy. They smell nice though, don't they? Uh -huh. Not long left. Right, okay, we've got Winnie back. I'm so stressed. We've got Winnie back from the groomers so she's alright. They've had to put some stuff on her little feet to stop it bleeding. It's hot. Ruby doesn't like it because she's upset, aren't you? Poor little Winnie. Um, I've got a nice cup of coffee in my handbag mug. James is very busy baking some more cakes. The brown ones are done. He's now making some white ones. No, I'm um, And because I've bought the red car, it's got to go back to the garage for a little bit of work on the exhaust first. Yeah, so we've away. got to take um, the car to the garage. I'm just so confused. Maybe a little tomato, as I've named it. So me and Tomato are going to the garage now. And it's got to be left there to have an exhaust thing done so it won't be as noisy. Um, and then we'll collect it and it'll be mine. So let's take it to the... Just, just drop me a text, mate. And I'll meet, I'll meet on the road. I put uh, a replica. Right, we're back in the car. So we're just driving back home. Hope the little people are okay with their cakes. Um, so we're just driving back home. We're going to have some dinner and then. Cars, my new red car has got to stay there till Wednesday, so no new car till Wednesday. Right, we've made it home and Ruby's been <laughs> very busy decorating. <laughs> not sure how we're going to fit them in a tin with all these things on them, but they're the brown ones and the white ones are not finished yet. We've got to do them, haven't we? Yes. Wow, these look very impressive. <laughs> oh, right, everybody's finally gone out. My hubby's gone out working, Ruby's gone out to play, James has gone out on to see his friends, so he's gone on the bus. I'm finally alone. It's the first day of the holidays. Look at the state of my house. Can you believe? Well, you all know I sprung clean it, sprung. Spring cleaned it all about 10 days ago and everywhere was immaculate. Pfft. I don't know why I bloody bothered. <laughs> Look at it. Obviously, I've got a mattress in my hallway, which when my hubby gets back, we're going to lift onto the bed and sort that out so that'll be gone. But there's stuff in the hallway, there's stuff all over the work tart. Obviously, we have been baking cakes, but Oh my god, it's just, it's a bloody mess. It does my head in. You work so hard to keep it clean, don't you? And then within a day, it just looks like this. <laughs> it's so horrible. Anyway, so we've now got to one o'clock, so I'm going to get myself some dinner. Um, I'm going to make a cake because I really want to make this posh recipe I've seen. And then we'll do a bit of tidying up, so we've got a bit of baking to do on our own. Right, there's my little dinner. So I've got seafood sticks, little tomatoes, mackerel in olive oil. So I'm going to have a quick dinner and then get on with my baking. When his paws, bless her. So they caught her nails. They put um, some stuff on it to stop it bleeding. But, oh Winnie, they caught your claw, didn't they? Made it bleed. They said because she doesn't keep still, as we all know. I think they tried to cut it and obviously caught it. But I think both of them have been bleeding. I think she's tucked her other one underneath. Where's your other paw? 
Even poorly. Bless her. So just trying to get her to sit still so that it, she can rest it. Right, that's my dinner all eaten. So now I'm going to attempt this cake. I haven't made a cake for years, really, really long time. So it'll be interesting how it works out. It should look like that. Whether it will, I really don't know. But um, let's let's give it a go. So I've got all my recipe and all my stuff that I need. So let the fun begin. Right, all the mixtures in my bowl. So I've got my little hand mixer ready. I've never used a hand mixer before. I normally use just a wooden spoon, but the recipe does say use an electric hand mixer. And I did get bought it about two years ago and I've never used it. I'm so naughty. So uh, I'm gonna give it a go now. Right, that's it all mixed up and done. So now we've got to put it into two cake tins, which are ready and waiting over here, and then put it in the oven. Right, they're in, they're in the oven. Ooh. I'm so scared. <laughs> Let's hope that they rise up nice and neat, even and look really good. But meanwhile, we have to wash up. Ugh, this is the horrible bit, isn't it? The washing up. Right, they're out of the oven. I think this one's got a little bit burnt on the edge, but um, I don't think they're too bad. They've risen up and stuff, so I'm just going to wait for them to cool down slightly and then tip them out. Right, I've just put the little bit of cream and little uh, fairy wings and some chocolate chips on the little cakes that James and Ruby did. So. I just finished them off for them, so they look really nice. I'm so tempted to try one, but I'm not going to because I want to try a bit of my cake. Right, there's my cake. I don't think it looks too bad to say I haven't made a cake in like, I don't know, about seven years. So there's my cake. It's slipping a bit uh, with the cream. So we've got like lemon curd and double cream inside it. So I'm gonna put What's it. What's the white stuff on it? icing sugar on the top. Icing sugar. So it looks a bit squidgy, but I'm sure it will taste really nice. Mm. Right, cake all finished. Washing hung out. We need a coffee. Right, I'm gonna try one of the cakes. This is one that's got a little burn bit on the side, so I thought I'll have this one. So we've got a nice little cake and handbag of handbag handbag of glory. So off to enjoy my little cake. What my children made. The new mattress is on! Yay! Finally, we have a king size mattress on a king size bed. We've been waiting for this mattress for about five weeks. Oh, I can't wait. I'm so excited. Right, I've been on the phone to my mum. So, while I was on the phone to my mum, I've managed to rustle up a little Monday fry up. So, we've got Two sliced brown bread, which is my Slimming World um, little box of the day. We've got uh, corn sausages, tomatoes, two eggs, um, an onion ring, which obviously I'm going to sin, um, very low fat cheese slice, and some bacon. So off to enjoy my tea. Right, we're sorting out a new washing line, and it's just really funny because Lily the cat, even though she's quite old, has been chasing the washing line like a kitten. She's so cute. She's not going to do a lot now, she's on camera. Or oh, she might. <laughs> Get it. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Yeah, it's rather long. <laughs> oh, you're not supposed to be eating my washing line. I don't think she was so old. Right, there's my disastrous cake. <laughs> I know what I did wrong. I put the filling in while the cake was still warm and I shouldn't have done. So obviously all the lemon curd and the cream is sort of splodged out the sides, but we think it's gonna taste nice. So me and James are going to try a slice and we'll let you know. Wow, normally on a Monday night I'm on my cross trainer, but tonight I've sat and eaten that cake. <laughs> I think I'm having a night off tonight. I think sometimes you need to, I have lost Probably about half a stone anyway, so I'm nearly more or less where I want to weigh. So, um, but I thought for tonight I'm just gonna have a night off. Whew. Uh, it is holidays after all, isn't it? But I'm only having tonight off, no other night. <laughs> Otherwise, you slip back to being naughty again. Oh, but the cake! Oh my god, the cake! The cake was absolutely beautiful. So, if you're interested, um, I can put the recipe on Instagram or something, or I can email it you. It is so nice, it's so moist. Uh, melted in your mouth, the lemon was really lovely, you could taste a little bit of the apple and 
beautiful. I would definitely be making it again. It was so nice. So if you do enjoy baking and you want the recipe, just contact me and I'll forward it to you, my dear. So, oh, right, off to enjoy my drink now. Have my nice cup of coffee. Right, my dears, final little vlog of the day. Thank you so much for watching. Share my little day in England. Obviously, we've had a busy day. Really, really busy and very, very stressful. So, Oh, so we're ending the day on a bit of cake and relaxation. So thank you very much for joining me. If you do enjoy life in England, daily vlogs, handbags, shopping, and whatever else we get up to, then please subscribe to my channel and come and find me on Instagram as Mrs. Crazy Bag Lady. So I love you and leave you, and I'll speak to you tomorrow. Bye.